In this video I will share with you how to do this design using an online t-shirt maker. This online tool also allows you to create your own mockups and download them to use for your print-on-demand business, or your online store. If you are new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button for future print-on-demand tips and design tutorials. Now, let's start. Yeah. Yeah. Our today's website is called Vexels. Vexels is a complete platform where you can find ready for print designs, vector graphics, editable designs, in addition to other design tools. For today's tutorial, we are going to focus on Vexels t-shirt maker tool, which you can use online to design in easy and simple ways. You can try this t-shirt maker for free from the link in the description. Once you open the t-shirt maker, you have the option to design directly on a mock-up, or on an empty artboard. On the left side, you can toggle between the graphics tab, the shapes tab, or the drawing tab. You can use the draw tab if you want to draw your own design. However, it might be a little bit advanced for beginners. So, let's get back to the graphics tab. Under the graphics tab, you can search for any graphics to use for your design. For today's tutorial, I will search for burger graphic. However, I decided to use another burger graphic from outside the t-shirt maker. If you have a Vexels subscription, you can download any graphics from Vexels design library and upload it to the t-shirt maker. I like this ready for print design. However, I need to delete some parts of it before using it in the t-shirt maker. To do that, I decided to use a free website called Pixlr. On Pixlr, you can delete any part of any PNG file easily. So, I will open the PNG file that I have downloaded from Vexels. Using the eraser tool from the left menu, I will delete the text from the image. You can increase the eraser size from the top menu if you want. After you finish, you can export your new file as a PNG and save it on your computer. Now going back to Vexel's t-shirt maker, you can use the upload button to upload the new edited PNG file. Using the text tab, I will add some text. You can also change the text color and stroke from the text menu. Now let's add more text and change the font. Using the text shapes, I will use a curved shape for my text. You can also use the Layers tab to move any item to the front or to the back on your artboard. Now, let's continue adding more text.
You can also add shadows to your text from the text tab if you like. Now, let's search for stars to add to the design. I like this one. You can duplicate any item on your board using Ctrl plus C to copy, and Ctrl plus V to paste. I will add more stars to fill the empty spaces. After you are satisfied with the end result, you can choose your mock-up from the left menu. Once you click the download button, you will have your final design downloaded in PNG format along with your chosen mockup. Now stay tuned for upcoming videos explain Vexel's platform. Thanks for watching.